is cleaning up after finding a community building vandalized. Our Haley Bull is also working on this story tonight and is learning more about the changes the Gandy Civic Center is now making after discovering the damage. I'm like, okay, something's wrong. Sean Brown knew something wasn't right when he stopped by the Gandy Civic Center. I noticed that the window on the right door was broken. What he says he discovered? Hundreds of dollars in damage to a building serving as a community anchor in South Tampa. How unfortunate and how frustrating it is that someone or maybe more than one thought, you know, let's go around and, and create some destruction. Brown believes someone took a bowling pin from a haunted house on the property, broke off doorknobs, smashed an electrical area, broke the front door window, took baked goods. And then over here, oh, one of the big uh, uh, issues uh, came from them taking the bowling pin and uh, completely breaking the uh, spigot. So Sunday, community members banded together, changing the locks, boarding up the window, cleaning up the mess. I was very upset because it hasn't happened in the time that I know of that I've been here. Vivian Hart is a Gandy Civic Association member for nearly 40 years. Let them work and pick up and clean up what they did. And, and teach a little respect for other people's property. The Civic Association says this property, where scouts meet, a church gathers, and residents hold events, will now be guarded with security cameras. It's sad that this is where society's kind of heading towards. In Tampa, Haley Bull, ABC Action News.